Counseling Microskills, Synthesis 1. The purpose of this video is to demonstrate a variety of microskills introduced in Chapter 2 of our ebook. Okay, Sandra, um, nice meeting you here today. And as you know, we're using Zoom as a platform. And I would like to let you know that I'm in my own office space right now. Uh, there's no one in my house, actually. My, my family are, are in school. So um, I wanna share this as a private and confidential space so that you know that it's, it's safe to share here. Transparency. Okay, great. That that helps me kind of relax a little bit and feel a bit more comfortable. Thanks. Mm -hmm. and, and I hear the word comfortable. So paraphrasing. You're comfortable in your own space and you have some privacy now, Sandra? Clarifying. I do. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That sounds good. So tell me a little bit about what you would like to talk about today, Sandra. Probing. Well, I've been really thinking a lot about the impact of um, the pandemic on relationships. So on my own relationships in particular, but kind of more generally as well. And I'm, I have this, there's sort of this weird um, experience. Maybe it's common to other people, but I feel like the longer it goes on, the less I am engaged with my friends and family. And so, um, and yet I, because I'm such an introvert, I'm not actually really feeling the weight of that so much other it's more of a cognitive thing like oh this is really interesting um how how easy it is to become disconnected engaging through body language and active listening mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so some challenges engaging relationships right now paraphrasing mm -hmm. i think it's i think it's that i I'm busy and like I said, I'm introverted. So I'm happy, you know, being on my own and working on my own. And I spend so much time on Zoom during the day. And then I just kind of like, it's a big sigh at night to not be on the computer. And so then to think about setting up more Zoom time to talk to my friends. Um, Engaging through body language and active listening. I miss them and I want that connection, but uh, yeah, it's, I'm kind of getting a little bit complacent about it. Complacent. Paraphrasing. Yeah, it's kind of, it's kind of odd. I, because I'm missing my friends and at the same time, um, I have a hard time motivating myself to make it happen. Mm. Minimal encourager. Yeah, I'm not really sure what to make of it, you know, and I, I think it's not, I mean, other people seem to also be experiencing similar things and maybe we're just all kind of huddling down and waiting for this to be over. Um, but I'm a little bit worried about, yeah, how disconnected we're getting from each other, the people that I would normally be spending time with pretty regularly. So you're worried about being disconnected with other people. Paraphrasing. Yeah, it's, um, and it's interesting because I'm an introvert. My spouse says she's an introvert, but she's pretty close to the edge <laughs> of extrovert. So she tends to be the one who does more of the uh, initiating and the social connection. And I'm lucky that I can just follow along if I'm busy and be mm -hmm. part of things that she set up. But we're both kind of feeling this um, less motivation around it. So it's kind of interesting. So you're in it kind of together, feeling this similar way. Paraphrasing. Yeah, and maybe that's, um, maybe that just reinforces the, the tendency to get lazy about it and not take as much initiative. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Minimal encourager. Yeah, I, I think it's silence. I think for me, it's that, uh, I have, I have this sort of overall sense of um, loss around the pandemic and the the pieces of relationships that are that are 
that I'm struggling with are part of that overall sense of loss. And so engaging through body language and active listening. This is obviously isn't ending anytime soon. So, um, you know, we've, we kind of have gotten into this bit of a lull and how do I, how do I start to get myself moving again in terms of being connected with my friends more and reaching out to them more? Um, it's not that I'm not at all, but it does feel like something has um, shifted in me. Mm -hmm. Minimal encourager. The lull is difficult right now. Paraphrasing. Yeah, it's just like, it just feels like it's sitting there and I'm not really doing anything about it. Mm. Minimal encourager. <laughs> 